much ma'am say what kind of place is this anyway you know they when they said you were up on your farm I thought well maybe you're Don't raising tell avocados me you've never heard of a fat farm oh this is a fat farm gee you know it looks more like a temple so this is a place where people come to reduce oh and uh, body revitalization um, we have a whole program here beauty and hair design uh, but our main emphasis is on uh, reducing I see this would be a terrific thing for my wife to see. You know, she's got a little problem in that well, area. Well, we'll put her on the list. Um, it's only $200 a day. Now, did you have something to say to me? I think we ought to forget about that wedding list and see if I can find a more uh, inexpensive As you can see, Lieutenant, I, I'm on a very tight schedule. If you didn't have anything to say, I really must be Oh, ma'am, listen, don't worry about that. You go about your business. Now, I'm not going to interfere with your schedule. You do whatever you have to do, and I'll just tag along, and don't you worry about it. You know who I met today? A fellow named David Lang. He had some very nice things to say about you. I can imagine. But you know what? It's just possible that this Mr. Lang might know more than he's willing to admit. Uh, I mean, about what Mr. Lessing might have been up to and how he expected to get more money. Lieutenant, David Lang hasn't told the truth about anything for 50 years. You know, I was wondering about that because, you know, you're so different, and that's what I admire about you. When you don't like somebody, you... You just come right out and you say it. I mean, when you fire Dr. Two, Murchison three, four, and Lessing and everybody else. Two, three, four, Lieutenant, I have to go in this way. I'm afraid you're just going to have to come back another day. Ma'am, you just do whatever you have to do and don't worry about me. I certainly don't want to interfere with anything. Newt Sunbathing, Lieutenant. I'll be in town tonight if you'd like to call me then. Uh, no, that's all right, ma'am. No, I'll just wait right out here. You do whatever you have to do. Oh, oh, I just thought of something. Uh, uh, didn't you say you wanted to talk to Dr. Murchison? Uh, yes, but we haven't been able to find him. Oh, that's because I found him. He's right through that door. Go right straight down the corridor and to your left. Oh, fine. All right, well, thank you, but uh, I'll uh, talk to you later. Mm -hmm. 